Thanks for joining us. Charlotte is off tonight. The Badger 2020 football schedule is out, opening up the year under the Friday night lights. September 4th against Indiana, plus home games against Minnesota, Purdue, Illinois, and Rutgers. So far, no kickoff times have been set. The UW is still finalizing plans for practices, which could start as early as tomorrow. It's still unclear if fans will be allowed into games. It'll have a big impact on game days. Our Maddie O'Neill live outside Camp Randall with the story. Maddie. Well, we're expecting a much emptier Camp Randall Stadium if games go on as planned. Each Badger football home game brings in about $16 million to the state economy, according to a report. And those home games make up a large portion of the annual yearning earnings of bars and restaurants nearby. About a third of those at Buckingham's just down Regent Street. For us, it's a huge deal. Those are our biggest days of the year. Buckingham's co-owner Scott Narrett says it's meeting people, yeah, can... even on those busy 17-hour Badger game days. That makes it all worth it. Uh, yeah, we're not meeting so many people lately. Lately, things look different, too. Emptier. I mean, it's, it's a tough year for everybody. A year he doesn't expect to end with a football season, despite a newly released Badger schedule. Let's just kind of wait and see. Um, we just got to be ready for anything. Ready to open their parking lot as a beer garden as usual without knowing what restrictions there might be yet and work with a limited capacity inside if the season goes on. UW Athletics is preparing for the possibility of a fall season with fewer fans inside Camp Randall which has implications for businesses along Regent Street and downtown that welcome the thousands of fans, bars and hotels alike. Destination Madison, an organization that works to increase tourism, says in a statement, We know this fall will be different without those fans, but understand UW is addressing the need to prioritize public health. We support the decision and plan on welcoming people to home games once again next year. Hi guys. I think I actually hope that the season gets pushed back to spring. Uh, it's the best chance where there could possibly be a vaccine and treatments. Whatever the football season looks like, Narrett says they'll meet the challenge. Just got to deal with what we got and do the best we can. The Badgers are scheduled to start their season Friday night, September 4th against Indiana here at Camp Randall. All right, Madeline O'Neill reporting outside the stadium tonight. Maddie, thank you. No